and its state's rights. This doesn't cause the federal government to do anything. What it allows is for the states to do what they have already passed laws on. And uh, I can see this from the standpoint of, a, of an individual. I know that in Wyoming, if you buy something on the internet and you're not charged a tax, you're supposed to fill out a form, you're supposed to send it in. That's a difficult thing to do, hard to even keep track of. And uh, this will eliminate that, that problem of individuals wanting to pay their tax but not knowing exactly how to do it. I know it from the standpoint of a small businessman. Uh, if they have the experience of somebody coming in, trying on the goods, finding out exactly what they want, the color, the style, the feel, everything, and then ordering it on the internet. And the even more ironic part of it is when they have a problem with it, they bring it back to the local retailer to fix it. And uh, I've seen it from the standpoint of a mayor. I know in Wyoming that at least 30% and up to 70% of the revenue of the municipalities comes from the sales tax. And that's on a declining basis at the, at the moment. That's not only what they run the city's streets and snow removal and, and uh, a lot of the, the police, the fire protection, even education gets affected by the, by the sales tax. But uh, I've seen it from the standpoint of a legislator as well. And I know when we passed those taxes, we didn't say, okay, we just want to discriminate against the local business that pays the property tax, hires people locally, and participates in all the community stuff. And if you're out of state, we're going to let you off the hook. No legislator ever passed a bill like that. So this is one that corrects all of those things and uh, brings fairness to the marketplace and I think will make a significant difference, particularly in communities where they'll still be able to help out some of the charitable organizations and, and activities that'll have to go by the wayside if this bill were not to pass.